Star Wars Church of Yetiism co-founder Daniel Jones has reviewed Star Wars The Last Jedi, which came out today December 14. Star Wars fans have been eagerly awaiting the release of the franchise's latest installment, Star Wars The Last Jedi, and none more so than Welshman Daniel Jones. The 31-year-old is the co-founder of the Church of Yetiism, a religious movement he started with his brother Barnett. Back in 2008, I was being hounded by media asking oh my god, are the Jedi gonna die? Jones reveals to the Radio Times, regarding the title of the latest film, Is this the end of all Jedi? Is somebody turning into a Sith? So going into the cinema, I was super apprehensive, I was like oh my god, what's gonna happen? So, what did the Jedi make of the film? It was awesome, he told the mag, it's constant edge of your seat excitement. You just couldn't relax, you know in the Phantom Menace they would go to Tatooine and just bugger about? There was never any of that. Jones says the movie reminded him of previous installments. In typical Star Wars fashion, they were able to have you emotionally connected to the characters all the way through the movie, he told the Radio Times. You have that sense of relationship with the characters and you want them to survive. You want them to get there and get out the other end, regardless of what they are. Those bits make Star Wars so interesting, and they did it again in this movie. I loved it. He did. However, say that the slapstick jokes are a bit too much like Guardians of the Galaxy and that some scenes were too light-hardened. Read his full review here, you can read an Emmy's review of the movie here 9 burning questions we're left with after Star Wars The Last Jedi warning spoilers The film's director dedicated the LA premiere to late star Carrie Fisher, on December 9th. The actress passed away last year after suffering a severe cardiac arrest on a flight from London to Los Angeles. The film marks her last performance as General Leia Organa. Meanwhile Star Wars actress Daisy Ridley has denied claims that she has ruled out a return to Star Wars once the current trilogy reaches its conclusion, despite it previously being reported that she has shut the door to a potential return after the release of Star Wars Episode 9, which is set for release in 2019. Star Wars The Last Jedi is in cinemas now.